know what that is it's a five or it's a five five six uh cartridge neck down to fit a 30 caliber projectile shooting some 145 grain barnall steel cased just have some basic iron sights on it nothing fancy but we're gonna take a few shots and see how she does all right first time this gun's ever been shot that's why i'm taking the first shot in case something were to go wrong just gonna aim for the dirt nothing crazy Awesome. That little target down there, if you want to show them that diddly wob, take a few shots at it, see where she's placing it. Brielle's turn. Is that better? Yeah. It is? Okay. What do I aim for? Aim for whatever. Shoot whatever you want. Actually, don't shoot over there, but shoot here. <laughs> I'm trying to get on something even. Good luck. This, this field just got tilled. This is the 300 blackout. What are you going for? A soda. Okay, hit it. Should be port of aim, port of impact. Ooh, shot just to the left of it. Watch your trigger pull. Ooh. Right below it, you're right below it. There you go, look at that. Good shot, weapon on safe, there you go, awesome. You did a great job, let's go look at it. Holy macaroni guys. We're shooting 145 grain Barnell FMJ 300 Blacks. Look at it steaming. That is so cool. You obliterated. You hit it right down here at the base too, it looks yeah, like. Yeah, because if you gotta shoot a guy, you gotta get him in the cross. You did a good job, honey. I feel, it feels wrong. I feel like I crotch shot it though. <laughs> it's all right. How does it feel? You like the recoil on that? So this is gonna be her new home defense weapon. I should've went for the orange one. You can do it. I say orange. Orange. Say orange. 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 I'm going to make a t-shirt that says that. Because <laughs> my mom's from New Jersey, and so I got some of her accent. Yeah. All right. Stay tuned. Do you like the iron sights better than the scope? Yeah. You do? Mm -hmm. Okay. That's why I was thinking, because scope's a little bit, for newer shooters, it's a little bit more difficult. Um, I know how to use them pretty well. That one's probably too big of a scope on that gun, so I'm probably going to switch that out. But, uh, well, also because my archery is more like this. Okay. Like yeah. So it's definitely going to stick with. I was thinking about getting a red dot. We'll have to look. I don't think you'd want that, though. I it's mean, personally, we get a good flashlight and a good grip, and you should be all good. All right. I want a laser. You want a laser? Sure. <laughs> all right. On you, honey. Yeah. What are you aiming for? Orange. What were you aiming for? The orange. Orange? Looks like you shot behind, or to the right of it. Let's yeah, try it again. Because it jiggled. Okay, it's all off of safety. All right, so on fire. There you go, direct hit. Awesome, let's go take a look. All right, it's okay, hon. We can get the mud off later. You should stand on this side. Stand on that if side? If the grass right. comes out, cotton. You're shooting low, so where are you, what are you aiming on here? Here? The label. Okay, 
So typically, since like most guns are typically sighted for 100, try aiming a little bit higher because bullet trajectory is weird. It's like it goes, it's just totally weird. I'll have to look at a ballistic chart. I've never shot the Ranger Blackout. Interesting that you're shooting low, but then again, we are shooting at what, 20 yards, not even that. The oranges are dead. You split that baby too. Let me see if we can find where it actually hit. I think it hit right there, guys. See that? Uh... I'm going to explode a pumpkin. You want to explode a pumpkin? All right, let's do it. I can't steal all the sodas from you. That's not fair. Even huh? though you shot my pumpkin. Yeah, I did shoot her pumpkin. She's kind of mad at me for that. Awesome sauce. Let's take a look. She's aiming for a pumpkin, y'all, so let's see if she can hit it. Which one, right or left? The one that you didn't shoot. The one that I didn't shoot. Just below it. Aim higher. What should I technically aim for? What? I'm shooting low. I, what should I aim for? Aim higher. So aim directly above it. And let's see where it goes. Like just like two inches above it. Aim like two inches above it. <laughs> you got caught on your what? My bra. Oh God. And there's a reason why I whispered it, Ethan. Okay, taking it off closely. Aim just a little bit higher. Hmm. You keep shooting low, hon. Because you're videoing me and I'm getting nervous. All right. I'm sorry. Brielle has two rounds left, and then we're going to start off this mag. So double tap it or do whatever the heck you want to do. Nice and dirty. Let's steam in there. All right, um, it's my turn to shoot now. Let's see I want to see shot. where I shot. I think they're dead, hon. If we come back next year and there's just a bunch of pumpkins. There probably will be. Too many rounds we have left. Two rounds again. That's awesome. Do you want to finish off these last two, or can I shoot them? Do you want to shoot them? Yeah. Yeah. All right. So we're gonna put this back here. Yeah, kick it if you want. Want to kick it? Why would you move it last <laughs> second? Hold it. I won't hit your hand. You like that? Uh, what's that one? The cartoon Charlie Brown? Yeah, that's what you just did to me. Right now, we are shooting some of this um, tumble around. So basically, the box said as soon as these impact, they're going to tumble, which most bullets tend to do, so I don't know why they did it. Um, I don't know what grain these are, so it's going to be interesting to see how these differ. We just shot 145 bar and all, which I just realized with the Russian ammo ban, that ammo is worth like three times what I paid for it, probably. So you're welcome, honey. I love you. So here we go. 20 rounds. Bring a blackout out of... I'm going to call this gun the Frankenstein gun because... I got an Anderson lower, uh, some random, I don't remember who makes the BCG, don't remember who makes the Ambi uh, charging handle, then I have an arrow upper and then some little shop that I bought irons from, but uh, let's go. Ready? That was weird, give me a second. She's a little bit sticky. Good. This is brand new, but uh, we're going to make it work. Dust that off real quick. Make sure I choose the right mag. There we go. I'm going to go for the pumpkin on the right.
Hallelujah. I like those rounds. They seem a little bit more punch. They have a little bit more punch than those other ones. So let's finish off these pumpkins. Dead, hon. If we come back next year and there's just a bunch of pumpkins, like there that. probably will be. Too many rounds again, huh? Two rounds again. That's awesome. Do you want to finish off these last two or can I shoot them? Do you want to shoot them? Yeah. Yeah. All right. So we're going to put this back here. Yeah, kick it if you want. Want to kick it? Why would you move it last second? Hold it. I won't hit your hand. I like that. Uh, what's that one? Fucking Charlie Brown? Yeah, that's what you just did to me. We have two rounds left. That's the pumpkin right there. It's going to go away. It's no longer going to be with us, I'm afraid. Here we go. Like all those, I get so many comments now about like, what, what the what the hell is wrong with your stance, bro? I'm like, I'm not trying to be a tactical Jimmy. What do you want me to do? Like, uh, like uh, Sergeant What's His Face taught me in MCT. 